Yeah, they're not too sure about me. They you can hear, you can hear that pipe rolling. They still want to be over here with their mamas. Actually, the bucket and the lid, they don't have to be mounted to tires. They could be mounted to a piece of plywood or left unmounted.
very hilly ground, quite a bit of rainfall in, in a year. We have about 72 inches of rainfall. We had a double parlor before, 24, 24. When we had 100 cows, it was fine, but uh, now we've grown up to 650 cows. We went to Dairy Master factory and uh, making over 90% of the products themselves. In the end, we took the decision to, to go for a 70 point Dairy Master. We saw that um, Dairy Master offered a very superior package with everything involved. Having stainless steel means that it will last forever. That's why we went for Dairy Master as well, as was the state amount of stainless in, in the build. Uh, other competitors would take two or three months to, to install the parlor, which uh, to me would mean that I'd have to be there more time. And with Dairy Master being here for only a week, it was uh, it was ideal for us, really. They soon got into things, and uh, by the end of the week, uh, we had uh, all the rotary installed. Start on milking, everybody was like, mostly excited about what was going to happen. Um, so after two milkings, uh, all the cows were coming on fine. It's unbelievable how they've adapted to the rotary uh, from a herringbone. And uh, before we had uh, one or two cows fidgety in the old parlor, and now they just seem so settled in, in a rotary parlor. And uh, I think it's a fact that they are, are on the move and they have their individual stores, which makes them uh, more relaxed uh, during the milking time. Put on ACRs, cluster fresh, auto teat spray, We've also in, incorporated the Moo Monitor heat detection collars uh, into the parlour as well, which works very well with the um, drafting kit and all the cows bullying in the morning is drafted automatically for us. After installing them, the value for money is incredible. We've uh, been using it for a year now and uh, all the cows have been picked up. And, and also the activity, you know, picks up cows which aren't very well and so that's valuable as well. We decided on a 31,000 uh, Dairy Master milk tank. You know, looking to the future, we thought uh, we'd have enough uh, capacity for future expansion. The, the amount of compressors are running is very small, only uh, a couple of hours in the middle of the night. And uh, we found that it works very well. The, the milk in the tank is at three and a half degrees. We've had the milking time. You know, the quality of life we have and our staff is much easier and cows are lying down more hours in the day than they are standing in the collecting yard. These days, you, you need to make uh, farming more attractive for youngsters. And uh, with this type of milking parlour, 70.23, it makes them attractive to, for youngsters to uh, come home to the farm and. Uh, Look to the future to producing milk uh, cheaply and uh, efficiently.